Chris Pulaski here with Dawn, the Wheaton Terrier, and I'm going to demonstrate how to trim a Wheaton Terrier ear. So let's tighten up. Who is that, Dawn? All right, first thing we're going to do is we're going to set the um, adjustable juice cordless clipper to the second setting. And I'm going to clean the whole inside of the ear out. I start with the hair that's growing the opposite direction and get all of that hair that's growing around the ear canal out. Of course, we've already plucked and flushed and cleaned Dawn's ears. Nice and clean. Got a little dark pigment there. Um, but you want to get the whole inside the ear with the grain. Always with the grain. Much safer if you go against the grain. It's very easy to cut the leather. It feeds the clipper right into the edge. So, <laughs> take a look. Alright, the whole ear clean. Now, I'm going to back it up to the middle or sometimes even the longest next to the longest setting. And right where the ear breaks, I'm going to stay just below it and I'm going to come down. And I'm going to blend, okay, I'm going to blend with the grain. Okay. All right, so this gives me a little bit room to blend because what's supposed to happen with this ear is that when they're perked up, they break just above the skull this hair blends all this into like kind of a half moon shape. All right, then the next thing we're going to do is just simply trim with the grain. Okay, and we're going to come up. Never, never, never go against the grain, especially not with scissors. Hold that thumb kind of there so you guide the scissor. And everything's looking good. And then the last thing you're going to do is take your blending shears with the grain and you're going to soften that line into the ear. Okay, and that's your 45 tooth blenders. That's it.